Good morning. This campsite's really, really cool. <laughs> it should be like right on the edge of the cliff. I'm not gonna lie though, I woke up quite a few times in the night thinking that like a big rainstorm was about to roll in and sweep us down the hill. Cause I have a feeling like the weight of these vehicles this close to kind of a soft edge in California, you know, we're asking for a mudslide here. But perfect weather. We're doing fine. The Highway 1 section of Big Sur is all closed down and because of the, all the rainstorms that we've had so uh, we won't be able to actually drive that and without that I don't really have anything between here and San Francisco. I have a lot of friends in San Francisco right now that I'd like to see so might as well make a long haul of it. We might even hit some interstates. God forbid. So yeah that's the plan. Make some miles today. Maybe see some stuff. Oh, well, while Michi is just getting ready to head out, I'm doing a little bit of repair because uh, last night we almost ate dog instead of chicken. And uh, the reason for this is Champ has this, like he's a great dog and I love him very much and you guys seem to like him a lot. But there's a few things you need to know about him. First of all, his barking. His barking is super irritating. He's got to the point now where he just can't help himself. Like no matter how much discipline, how much like try and I try to train him out of it, it's just not gonna change. He's too old now, he's just stuck in it. And so when someone knocks at the door, he loses his shit. And this has resulted in my laptop being destroyed last night where I was charging it and he, Miche knocked at the door and opened the door and he charged her, slammed through the charger cable through my laptop on the ground, smashed the charging mechanism in it. So I'm doing a little operation today to try and fix that. So you know, pets, is like, he's like, that's why I say he's like, it's not, it's not my little baby. He's my irritating freaking housemate. He doesn't pay any bills and wrecks all my shit. I love him though. Not last night.
All right, so we're taking a little break here. We're gonna get some breakfast, maybe, and uh, make some plans because Michi wants to get a haircut. We both really need showers. And uh, we're trying to make it to San Francisco today. So, you know, we want to look presentable by the time we get there. I've already got a fantastic haircut though, so I'm feeling good about it. So instead of buying breakfast, we're really looking for, kind of forward to those donuts, but since they wouldn't give us a bathroom, we're just gonna make our own little street tacos here. Breakfast, street tacos, then back on the road. And they closed the YMCA in this town, so we're gonna have to keep going and find something else. Oh, I was just gonna use the tortilla as a utensil, but no. No, no, you gotta make it a white person way and use utensils for utensils. Mm. <laughs> Cheesy palooza. I made a mirror to give you one day. Good evening, made it to San Francisco after six and a half hours of driving. Oh boy, it's not much happened today unfortunately, but that countryside in freaking California, I cannot believe how green it is. I'm really looking forward to exploring more. I've got, I'm here with a, a buddy of mine that I met last year while I was here alone in San Francisco. His name's Jesse and he's like an experienced veteran at this. So it's really nice to have like a local to show you around and show you what's good. So I look forward to putting him in the vlog tomorrow and uh, getting some more stuff from him too because he's rad. Lo knows a lot of stuff about sailboat life, about van life, about traveling full time. It's a cool resource to have. All right, that's it for me tonight. The Street Camp, San Francisco. Good night. Yeah.